What we're looking at here is a stairway, exterior stairway. We have a, some bricks forming the stairs, treads and risers. And then we go to a concrete walkway and we have some pavers down here. Missing brick, this is a safety problem. Chips off of the nosing here. And of course, this electrical conduit, at least I'm assuming it's electrical conduit. Now this probably wouldn't be as bad if it was tucked tight up against the riser, or maybe if the stairway had a nosing on it, was tucked underneath the nosing. But uh, about since it's about an inch and a half to two inches off the ground, and about three inches away from the face of the riser, it's right there where you're going to step. And it would be easy, easy. I could see someone getting the bottom of their shoe hooked underneath this thing and tripping forward. At least you wouldn't be tripping down. It'd be a little worse than that. But again, it all depends. You're, you're carrying, um, let's just say you're carrying two bags of groceries. You're really not paying attention. You got to get up the stairway like this and wham, you fall. Those two bags of groceries might provide you with a cushion, but they're not. It's not like your hands are free. You're going to be able to grab something and... Uh, restrain yourself or at least avoid getting uh, hurt is worse worse than if you didn't have anything in your hands and you were trying to save that. So I, I don't want to make a big deal out of this. If you are going to do something like this in a situation like this, all you need to do is pop up these three or four pavers, maybe this area here, run the conduit underneath and you're done. This isn't rocket science. If you have a stairway with nosing, a nosing on it, like a one inch overhang here, you could always tuck the conduit underneath it. I would imagine that would be a little bit better or shove it up tight up against the base of the riser. But there is one thing I would like to point out and that is that I can't think of any building codes that would allow you to do anything here except for remove these pavers and put it in the ground. And then if you do that, you're probably going to be need a an inspection and you're going to need the right materials. You're going to have to do everything correctly. But just to do something like this, and I understand, hey, I'm going to do it. I need to I need some power somewhere. I'm going to save some money and you just go ahead and do this half ass like this, you know, it might not be a big deal as long as someone ever doesn't get hurt ever. But the moment someone gets hurt, something like this, you're going to feel stupid doing it. You know, why did I do that? You know, and especially if you're the person who's going to get hurt, you're going to feel even uh, dumber. So there it is with that. I will not uh, chastise anybody for doing something like this. But uh, if someone gets injured, you're going to feel bad.